Derrick Rose, as far as I'm concerned, is finished. You're going to go through a lot of ups and downs. It's about how you attack those situations and learn from them. Father Time is undefeated. He's not the this same player. But I think that he is. I think he's in his 17th year. And as an older player, he can't give that level of effort consistently. What are you doing, LeBron? And I'll say it again about D-Rose. What in the world does he do at a high level? He declined as a player. We're not, we're not giving him a lifetime achievement award. No, no, about right now. Chris Paul alone does not get you to the playoffs. This is what we've been waiting for this king to appear. For this LeBron to show us what that goat thing really looks like. I just want people to know that, that I was just a winner. Somebody that fought, persevered through the question is simple. Is LeBron James at this moment playing the best basketball of his career in year 15? Before we continue, I just want to give a huge shout out to Raid Shadow Legend for sponsoring this video. It's funny because my brother always used to ask me if I had some games on my phone, knowing then well I had nothing but a chess game and a calculator for him. You got games on your phone. But that's the thing from the past though, because I'm not the boring brother anymore. Raid has gotten so popular over the last month that even memes are being made about them. But on a serious note, Raid Shadow Legend is a dark fantasy RPG game, which basically means it's cool as fuck. It's available on PC and every type of phone you might have, maybe not like Blackberry or something, but other than that, you, you're, you're good to go. It's also free, so I think it's a pretty cool price. There are so many challenges and different scenarios inside the games. There's also a lot of characters and champions that you can choose from. You can battle other clan boss to upgrade your champions to make them even stronger. My personal favorites are definitely Galek with his Hellraiser attack that destroys all opponents in one shot. Uh, there's also War Priest who gives a 25% extra on everybody's skills. And she's kind of bad too, I, I ain't gonna lie. You have multiple enemies and clans to battle with. The more you battle, the better you get and the more rewards you can unlock. You also have access to the new battle pass who is live right now. Uh, you can win rewards like free energy refill, gem, upgraded artifact sets, and new epic and legendary champions by completing daily and weekly challenges. So honestly, Raid is a super simple and entertaining game that you can download for free, so you don't have to watch your old photos when you're bored, you know? It's kind of trash. So if you are a new player, make sure to use my link in the description uh, to get 100,000 silver, one energy refill, one day XP boost, and one free champions. Uh, adjudicator, you'll find all your free rewards in your inbox right here. With that out the way, make sure y'all wash your hands because nobody's safe right now. Um, let's pray that the NBA comes back as soon as possible. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. You get up early and you work hard. Those times when you stay up late and you work hard. Those times when you don't feel like working, you're too tired, you don't want to push yourself, but you do it anyway. Um, that is actually the dream. Why can't I be the best player in the league? I don't see why. Why? 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 somebody tell you you can't do something when it comes to running the show captaining the ship being an orchestrator a facilitator a floor general anybody and i mean anybody that knows the game of basketball will tell you this brother's elite, 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 just elite. Chris Paul is an elite NBA player worth more than the max contract. The cap means some players will necessarily be underpaid. He's one of them. Chris Paul is by so far the best player, but the Rockets have just improved. A healthy D. Rose is not some good player. He is a superstar. Definitely. This dude is on another level. His name is Derrick Rose. He is big time. Not legit, not good, but great. Derrick Rose, one of the fastest guys in the league coming at you. Everything is dictated by Derrick Rose. Derrick Rose is having an MVP time season on a team that's 34 and 16. You take Derrick Rose off of the Bulls, and that team is a 500 team or worse. Rose with the shot. He I'm predicting right here, right now, that Derrick Rose will win league MVP honors.
LeBron prove to you what I and all the LeBron supporters around the world do. They're brilliant. He is the baddest man on the planet dribbling a basketball. Now, maybe there's someone up in Mars or Jupiter we don't know about him. Maybe he has like a 70 inch vertical and got the range like a, 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 a Tomahawk missile. I don't know. But on the planet Earth, he's the baddest man going. And I think that LeBron James has been nothing short of sensational. Is LeBron James a first ballot Hall of Famer right now? Without question. Nothing to even think about. One of the greatest players to have ever played the game. See, Sean. 52. No question. Second straight explosion from one of the game's greats. Nice fake by Kings. Oh, he stops it. for MVP, one young star in New Orleans suddenly burst into the race with a brilliant season of his own. I understand that being mentioned amongst those guys is, is not anything that I'm doing by myself. Every time they say Chris Paul MVP candidate and I hear it, I'm so excited because my teammates know, they know without a doubt that it's because of them. basketball yeah I wanted to prove everyone wrong but I thought wow I had to let that go and understand the career and the path um, I was heading down and um, I can't play that way when I'm out there I love to be happy I love to try to win every game or compete in every game that I play in and that's when I play the best basketball <laughs> Inside, hello. <laughs> I think like anybody else, like you're a reporter, so if you're trying to be the best at what you're trying to do. Or there's no reason for you to, to like put that work in. You might as well just be regular. That's just like how I look at look at it in this game where I'm putting all this time in, breaking my fingers, twisting my ankles, and why not be the best? I sacrifice a lot of things. I dedicate my whole life to this game. So why not win the best thing? You are not gonna be reckless. Your mind, you're just not gonna be reckless. When I look at it, my heart won't let it. He's a floor general. That's where his that's where his stardom comes from. His ability to run a show because he's definitely surreal on that level. Oh, I love it. Well, I mean, I, I can tell when a player you know, truly wants to be better. Derrick Rose is the fastest player I've ever seen with the ball in his hands. <laughs> Why not? Why can't I be the MVP of the league? Why can't I be the best player in the league? 
if anybody deserves to be mentioned in the same sentence as a Michael Jordan, it is Kobe Bryant and it is LeBron. Oh, please. I think anytime you can be associated with greats, it's a good feeling for myself. Um, one thing I try to, I try to be the MVP and the best player for our team. CP3 is a star, man. The most valuable player. Who's your MVP to point to this point? Rhodes. It's Rhodes. Yeah. Okay. Look at the, have you seen him play? It's just the third time in NBA history that a team playing at home with a chance to clinch the playoff series blew a double-digit lead uh, entering the fourth quarter. It was a collapse, as Stephen A. mentioned earlier. So, so break it down for us, my friend. What happened? The Clippers choked. Let's call it what it is. Um, this team just completely collapsed. Skip, I watched every moment of this game. I didn't miss a moment. I believe in God. I can't complain about anything. Yeah. This injury could have been worse. I couldn't be here talking to you. Like, yeah. oh, come on, it could have been so much worse. What's your decision? Um, in this fall, man, it's, it's very tough. Um, in this fall, I'm going to take my talents to South Beach and um, join the Miami Bridge. And we've supported him for seven years now. And for him to go on there and drag us through the mud for seven years and stab us in the heart, he deserves everything he gets. I hope he never wins anything in Miami. What it would just happen was disgusting. The guy gave up in game three, and this is what he has to reward us with. Some of these playoff heartbreaks are just awful luck. He fractured his right hand. Certainly not the way you want to end your season. Some wounds were self inflicted. But Paul's time in Los Angeles will be defined by what it did not do. He for a championship. I told you that I was like, man, tell them, if you ain't trying to contend with the Warriors, then what are we doing? They like, move off of a 34-year-old Chris Paul for a far superior, if not flawed, 30-year-old Russell Westbrook. Three years from now, he's making 44 million. He's 33 and slowing down now, he'll be 36 then. Derrick Rose had six different injuries this season, the worst of them being a torn ACL suffered in game one of the Bulls' first round playoff series against the Sixers. But nevertheless, sad altogether because Derrick Rose, as far as I'm concerned, is finished. Think of your most downest day in times that about 100. It ain't enough to describe how I felt at the time. So I only have one. Do you regret how it ended? Did you like to apologize for the way it ended? I don't want to apologize. Um, I think, um, you know, my intentions was um, not to hurt anyone. Um, you know, my intentions were solely on kids um, during the whole um, process. Um, and, you know, I always say, you know, decisions I make, um, I live with. What is going on in use? A source aware of the two star dynamic told McMahon that Chris wants to coach James, and Harden looks at Paul like, you can't beat your man, just shut up and watch me. Nobody believed in, in the beginning. You witnessed what happened. That was against the unathletic San Antonio Spurs, and LeBron James was pathetic, shooting 35% from the field in that series. The best player on the planet revealed himself to be the mentally weakest superstar we've ever seen. I try to see how long I can go through it because I try to make myself different than other people. When's the last time he was an All-Star? Four seasons. What's When's the, the last time he's been sense? healthy? He, he declined as a player. He has only played more than 70 games once in the last eight seasons. Here's the reality. When he was moved to the Thunder, the Thunder, the first thing they voice and say is we are moving and trading Chris Paul. The first thing, hey, he will never wear an Oklahoma City Thunder jersey. Chris Paul is no longer a great player. He is a good player, but not a great one. He's been a great player almost his entire career, but just watched the way he played last season, and he just turned 34 years old. Uh, Derrick Rose right now can't shoot. Uh, Derrick Rose can't stay healthy. He's going to get hurt again and again.
and again, it's been established. Think about this. Eight years, seven years in the league, we know what Derrick Rose is. He is the classic sports car. Lousy mileage, breaks down, hard to fix. He's not a good shooter. He's not a great defender. He's not an elite di distributor. That's just the way it is. Derrick Rose is the most overrated player in the last decade in this league. Chris Paul is to a point in his career where he'll never play 82 games. He'll never be able to get you to a season. And if we're going to talk about elite, one player, one elite player on a squad gets you to the playoffs. Chris Paul alone does not get you to the playoffs. Chris is going to go down as one of the greatest point guards we've ever seen play the game of basketball. He's going to be remembered for the pick and roll. But in all reality, Father Time is undefeated. He's not this the is, same player. This. Who dared to call CP3 a superstar. Wait a minute. I need to see a whole lot more in the postseason before I even think about putting a super in front of star in front of CP3's name. Games four, five, and six against the Dallas Mavericks disappeared, ran from the basketball. If you're looking at me, you will never know what I went through because I don't want you to know. As bad as it was, I got through it, and um, that's why I'm the person I am today. LeBron is better than Kawhi. LeBron is better than the Greek Freak. Congratulations on your 10th All-Star. Thank you. <laughs> How does it feel different from the first nine? Um, it's a lot different. Probably because it's been a while. LeBron James is still the best player be in the world. Fortune. Start. Great. Start. Great. Even defeat. Derrick Rose saved the game! 50 points for Derrick Rose! I would say LeBron James is the best male athlete of the decade. This is the decade where we saw him go from chosen one to the champion. Three-time NBA champion in this decade, 2012, 2013, and 2016. This guy was first team all NBA every year of the decade except last year. He went to eight straight NBA finals. It's over. Cleveland is a city of champions once again. OKC hadn't won a playoff series since Kevin Durant left. Vegas oddmakers predicted that this year's Thunder were in for a year of misery. But a funny thing has been happening in Oklahoma City this week. Just the way he approaches the game, here it is from a guy who's an MVP who's all about business. He makes mistakes just like everybody else, but it's, it's from a great place. It's from his heart. You want a guy like Derrick Rose on your team. You know, on the track. He didn't cry about it, he didn't whine about it, he didn't force his way out. He, he embraced this with open arms and you have just to Just a winner. Yeah. He's just a winner. Paul, Chris Paul is just a winner, period. You can put him wherever you want, he's just a winner.
Thank you.